majority of our students have hard lives. Families that are living in a one-bedroom apartment with two families, not one. They're exposed to the facilities at Genentech. Being inside a scientific building and what does that look like? What does a scientist look like? To get to know that they look like maybe their sister, their brother, their cousin, and that that could be them. Well, San Francisco is a friendly community. A lot of people know each other. You feel safe. My dad is from El Salvador. School is number one priority. I'm gonna give an assignment. It's difficult to assume that the kids will have the resources to do the research, to type a paper up. Um, I don't think a lot of kids actually have computers. When I first started here, I was in a portable. Trying to do labs was difficult. Trying to get four desks, put them together to make a table. So I do enjoy coming to school every day. I worked at Stanford Research Institute. I did immunology research, but decided that I had a great experience in my public education and so I just wanted to give back to the community that I grew up in. I love science. I learned best by doing hands-on work. I met some of my closest friends through doing lab. I am on my way to an A. I'm almost there. I like reading. Me gusta leer. Cuando sea grande quiero ser doctor. My favorite subject is math. They get to play with an idea. I like to do experiments. That has always been a value of science. That exposure could then lead into this interest of science that could then lead into middle school and it developed into high school and it developed into college. Science as a career. Mm -hmm.